Ken, here's a video of your 2021 Grey Wolf 26 MB RRBL. There's a vent in the back so you can open from the inside. You can circulate air. And in fact, there's one on both sides. There's stabilizer jacks on the corners. You can crank those down for stability. You got a uh, sewer hose holder underneath. Uh, we torqued the wheels at 120 foot pounds. The driver's done it. We we did it when it got here. I'd check it again a few more times just because they're aluminum. Um, there's a 30 amp cord. Comes with an adapter. If you want to plug it in at home, you can. Outside shower, hot and cold water. It looks like the guys are working on it now. There's a black tank flush. You can flush out your sewer system. So what you want to do is uh, take the cap off like it is now, hook your sewer hose up, pull the gate valve, dump the waste. After the waste is dumped, go over here, hook a hose up to the black tank flush, let it run for about five minutes at the most. Shut the hose off, close the black, you're done rinsing it. Pull the gray, that's the bathroom sink and shower and that rinses everything off for you. But just make sure when you're flushing that black tank out, um, it's the water's actually coming out the valve here. Cable TV, there's your water heater. It runs off gas or electric. If you want to turn off electric, it's switched here. If you want to run off propane, the switch is inside. So it, it runs off either one. There's your drain for your water heater. There's your VIN number. There's the date it was built. Here's your battery. Two 20 pound propane tanks. These are both full and ready to go. And how this works is this will point to the tank that you run off initially. When it empties, it turns red and switches over. So if you're pointing here and it's red, it's already on the last tank. This will raise and lower it. Obviously a great feature. Does have another solar panel hookup, but can't really see it, but you got one on the roof. There's your spare tire. Crank for the power tongue jack. Powered awning. Outside kitchen. This is your ice maker um, that runs off electricity. Outside shower, again. We've got a couple burners. Sink. Now these burners are, um, will run off the main propane tanks and there's your quick connect. And right underneath it, you got a ball valve you gotta turn on. Shut it off, unhook it, and you can slide this back in. You can um, watch TV out here if you want. You can plug it into electricity, hook it up to the antenna or the DVD player. So you can watch movies out here too if you want. There's your fireplace, runs off electricity. You can have it just for ambiance, like it is now. 62 degrees in here, air conditioner's working good. You can dim it. You can do low or high heat. And you can set your thermostat where you want it. And there's a timer. And that's uh, AM, FM, Bluetooth, HDMI, USB hookups. There's a spot you can hang your TV. This is gonna let you know how full the battery is. Fresh water tank, black, which is toilet, and gray water, which is all the drains. Water pump is for the fresh water tank. Propane switch for the water heaters next to it. And then the rest of these are lights. And this is your main awning in and out, and that's powered. Air works great. Uh, it's like the uh, stove top, you get this burner away from you, or the glass top. Turn it to high, push and hold it, and as you're holding it, you want to rotate the piezo. Same thing with the oven, turn it to pilot, push and hold. Refrigerator's 12 volt, it's 10.9 cubic foot. Runs off the solar panel and the battery, so it's a good size refrigerator. And we just plugged this in a little while ago and it's already very cold. Here's your heating and cooling. Um, you can do, just the one button here will control the features, so heat, off, 
fan, low and high, cool, high, low, that would be continuous, and then auto is thermostat controlled. Toilet, you want to drop your chemical in there, it breaks the waste down, breaks the toilet paper down, helps with the odor, and you just step on the pedal, and it'll open up the bowl and flush water at the same time. Looks like he's uh, running through all the systems. There's a ground fault. If you lose power in any outlet, it's probably tripped here, is what I would guess. Hope this video helps. Of course, if you have any questions, feel free to give me a call anytime. Thanks, Ken.